honestly not even prepared to show my face right now. It's Christmas Eve. <laughs> it's Christmas Eve and I've woken up looking like this. Um, so I'm just gonna get on the grind. There's a lot of things to do today. There's a lot of things to do to help out my family, get ready for everyone to come over. I need to do my bed. My grandparents are staying in my bedroom over the course of Christmas. So tonight, tomorrow night, and the night after that. My bedroom needs to be nice for them to stay in. I pretty much made it nice, but I just need to give it another clean round. I just need to put my bedding back on. I want to tan for tonight. I'm not going to tan everything. I'm just going to tan my stomach, my arms, this area, basically just the top half of my torso. Because I know what I'm going to be wearing tomorrow morning for opening presents. The only thing that's going to be shown is my stomach and everything else. I know that I want to okay hold on i know that um i need to do prep for tomorrow like i said like tan and then after my tan is developed i need to go in the shower obviously wash my hair and then after it's washed i'm going to curl it for tomorrow morning but it's just when to tan that because obviously i'm going to church tonight because it's like a tradition that we do each christmas eve night i think i'm going to be getting my shower and washing off all my tan and doing my hair before church and then it'll dry and then i'll go to church and then after church i can curl my hair but then i also need to plan some time to spend time with my family because that is what christmas is about as well as helping around with the house and getting things sorted and prep and everything i also need to remind my family that we need to be getting some squirty cream we've got to get that and what is hot chocolates without squirty cream and what is christmas without squirty cream like i love it also need to wrap my presents my gifts that i've given to people i don't even know if i can remember all of this but it's just nice having some skincare trying to awaken in the morning look at that i washed my face last night but obviously all of that is still on my face. I think I'm going to be cleaning around my bathroom a little bit because a lot of people stay at our house for Christmas. My family hosts Christmas. There is going to be quite a lot of people. And there's going to be my auntie, my granddad, my grandma. My sister is coming tomorrow with her kids. My sister's also coming with her fiance i hate that word for some reason my brothers are obviously going to be here my other auntie and uncle are going tomorrow so there are going to be a lot of people staying and a lot of people coming in and coming out we need it clean i need to remember to put my laundry in this morning i just got up and i watched some ingham family hauls i realized i probably shouldn't be watching that because chris I don't know if I can say this. Or if I get like demonetized. Yeah, no. But but then I ended up watching Amy Charlie's Christmas vlogs and Christmas hauls. I love her. She's actually really sweet. Okay. I'm just going to be doing a little bit of skincare. Get changed and then start with my first thing, which is giving my room a little bit of a tidy round. I have no idea why I look so rough. I'm gonna use some eye cream. I'm gonna use some of my ordinary miracle cream. And this skin tonic. Okay. Actually haven't used this in a while. This is the ordinary niacinamide. I've got a little thing on the side of my lip here. I don't think it's a cold saw, but it's something, maybe a spot. I'm gonna be putting some miracle cream on it. Then I'm going to just be using my jade roller. Oh my god, why did my voice go like that? <laughs> At least my skin tonic, this thing genuinely is lethal. You're not meant to spray it directly onto your face. You're meant to spray it on a cotton pad and then put it on your face. But, or you're meant to spray it in the air and let it settle onto your face. You know what? I'm actually going to do it the correct way. I'm going to put it on a little cotton pad and then I'm going to put it on my face. So this, I think it just tightens up my pores, finishes my skin off. That is my skincare done. Now I'm going to be changing into a comfy outfit for the day that I can do all my chores in. Let's go. Everyone is coming in an hour and a half, which is quite early. So I need to clean my room right now. First, we need to get rid of this bin bag. Um, I'm going to put it all on time lapse anyway. in my room and now it is tanning time i've closed my curtains just because i don't obviously want everyone looking in so i've just got my lights on and i'm really 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 warm for some reason but i'm gonna get onto the tanning so it has time to develop this is the bondi sans self tanning foam this is in the shade dark this is actually my mum's i have my own but it's honestly not the best tan so i'm using bondi sans today um i'm not gonna put 
a lot on just so I'm not very, very dramatically dark because that would be weird. I've got my buffer, the Bondi Sands Back Tanner. I don't really find this useful, but whatever. My Skinny Tan Mitt. Before I tan, I'm just going to apply some of my Victoria's Secret Velvet Petals Body Lotion just so that the tan can kind of absorb into it and my skin's very smooth. now so i've just put lotion on my stomach a decolletage and my arm area and on my neck put in some of the tan on the knit and then i'm going to be applying it to my arms okay so the tan is done i'm looking quite orange but i'm going to wash it off anyway setting off for mass which is church around six the time is now half past one i'll probably have to wash it off in like four hours which isn't a lot of time but i'm just hoping that it stays on some Vaseline on my lips because they need a little bit of therapy. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping that my tan looks nice in the morning. Next, I'm going to be wrapping all my presents. For some reason, like the whole of this video, I've been talking in a really posh voice. I think when I start filming, I just put on such a posh accent. It's not fake. Like, sometimes I do just randomly talk like that. I'm from Yorkshire. We kind of talk like this. I'm feeling way more alive now, so. This is the wrapping box. I think I'm gonna do it in this candy cane wrapping because look how cute that is. presents um, they're downstairs my family's just come over so i'm gonna be spending some time with them in a couple hours i'm gonna take my shower and then i'll all be ready for church i've washed my tan off and i've been in the shower and my hair is quite wet this is what i'm gonna be wearing for church i'm gonna be wearing something over it okay so don't bully me but this is my zara dress it has been making a very frequent appearance this month i just wear it a lot it's a maxi dress I don't know if you can see. This is what it looks like and it's really cute. For now, I'm just going to be wearing this cardigan with it. I'm not actually wearing this to church. I'm going to do my makeup really quickly. So I'm going to be setting off at half past six. It's currently ten past, so I've got 20 minutes. I'm going to be putting a little bit of eye cream on and I've got some mascara there. So it's going to rub that off. I did run out of eyebrow gel, but a hack you can use literally just any hairspray. Just spray it on your table. And then dip your brush in it and then brush your eyebrows and it will hold the hairs. I'm gonna be doing some really simple makeup. That is the wrong concealer. Oh, this concealer really is running out. I really, really need more. Blending it out. The thing about my family is that we don't go to church on Christmas morning. I don't think we ever have. It's just tedious for like to open presents on Christmas morning but on Christmas Eve it's just nicer to go to church in the evening because it's like a cute little evening thing and you can get dressed up and everything and don't be tired. Thinking about what blush to use I think I'm gonna go ahead with my cloud paint from Glossier if I can find. can't find my cloud paint so I'm just gonna be using my elf putty blush. Applying a little bit of setting spray to that. I really want to know your guys's Christmas traditions. If the comments aren't disabled on this one then just let me know obviously this is really dramatic don't worry this is not how my makeup is going to look in the long term because i've got my blender and i'm just going to blend it out i'm going to go in with some their real benefit tinted primer and after i've put the primer on i'm going to curl them oh these are for my lashes by the way what we usually do on christmas eve is well we clean up on christmas eve for everyone to come over and then on the night we chat with the family we always have the same meal on christmas eve usually we just have kind of like picky bits and cheese and we always have coca-cola ham and dauphinois potatoes dauphinois potatoes are like slices of potato they're cut up and kind of put it like a cheesy sauce kind of like potato lasagna i think of it it's really nice and it's got a crispy top and they're paired perfectly with coca-cola ham which is a big thing of ham and it's just cooked in cola it might seem disgusting but it's really good trust me and then usually on the night we'll like watch a christmas film and stuff like that on the morning obviously opening presents see we have christmas dinner and then we just play some games and i feel like everything just kind of flows it's a really cute day and it's really 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 nice i'm not going to vlog christmas 
today but what i am going to be doing is i'm going to be doing a haul of what i've got a lot of people love to see that which is weird because i don't usually like watching the hauls i don't know that people love hauls and christmas stuff so i'm gonna do a voiceover on this because you really couldn't hear anything i was saying in the wind but the shoes are from converse the dress is from zara the jumper is from toast the jacket is from my mum and i was wearing some chunky gold hoops which were really nice and um i swear it looked better in real life when the wind wasn't being awful and blowing i've just come back from church it was lovely i got chocolate so i'm back home now i would generally just watch a christmas film or something and then go to bed but what i was thinking about was curling my hair i don't think i am gonna curl my hair because i'm quite liking it straight i think i'm just gonna leave it straight tomorrow so that's the end of my christmas eve vlog i really hope you enjoyed stay tuned for my christmas haul um if you want to watch it if you don't it's completely fine please do subscribe i'm trying really hard to post out some videos and for the new year one of my resolutions is to try post videos regularly but if you subscribe and turn on the notification bell then you'll know whenever I post a new video. I hope you have the best Christmas. I will be posting this video hopefully on Christmas Day. So you guys can watch it on Christmas Day whenever you want. Have a lovely Christmas. I'll see you when I do my Christmas haul. Bye. All I want for Christmas. <laughs> you.